Zoe, what day is it? Um, Sunday. But what day is on Sunday? Packer Day! It's Packer Day! Zoe's excited, even All though right. she will not show Do you want to show it. us what we're having for dinner? Um, or for our I'm first, okay, this is our first Packer game of the season lunch, like every year, right? So show us what it is. What's this first thing? So we have our special dip. It's sour cream and cream cheese um, with taco seasoning, cheese, and lettuce. Then we have cantaloupe, grapes, um, potato chips, and I don't know what to call these. Oh, tortilla chips. Tortilla probably. chips. And then we have sloppy joes in here cooking. Because why do we eat sloppy joes on the first day of Packer Day? Because they're sloppy. Because they're sloppy and because they're good luck for the Packers. Right? Mm -hmm. So we got to have our sloppy, sloppy joes. <coughs> Who's going to win today? <coughs> Packers or the Bears? Packers. Packers for sure. <coughs> All right. See you later. The British are coming in about 15, 20 minutes and we shall begin. <coughs> Bye. The British are here. Hello. Hello. Yay. <laughs> Oh, look at Jake's even deck. There is one deck down. We got Cole taking oh a Packer nap four. already. I four. Four. Happy Packer Day. Happy Packer Day. I think there four. Oh, Corbin's already getting into the food. Those are Emily's eyeballs. Wait, come here. Come here. Come here. For Halloween. Oh, my. <laughs> Maybe if you. Okay, just one, okay, buddy? Can you chew that? It's really big. Yeah, Don't put it back in there. Just put it right here. Just put it right here. Yeah, you can chew it. It's like bubble gum. You might want to move those in. Might want to move those. Shelby girl and I are going for a walk this morning. She's loving it. So many smells. She smells. What's my little Shelby girl doing? Are you in your little nest? You're not chewing on your blanket, are you? Hey. Hey, punk. Quit doing that. Shelby girl likes these little fuzzy blankets, don't she, Shelby girl? Shelby, you're so sweet. Yeah. Are you fluffing? Oh my gosh. Mom. This works in perfect Shelby girl, what you doing? Did you get a new ball? What you doing? Oh boy, can you see what she's doing? She's taking all the fuzz off of the tennis ball. She's really going at it today too. She's made herself a nice little nest here. <laughs> and she's got a lot of stuff. Here's another old ball. You can see it's half defluffed. Can you see that? Got a ball. What's this over here? A little ducky with no head. Yeah. What's this you got? It's a bone. A squeaky bone that no longer squeaks because it has some holes. Oh, and then over here, well, it looks like we got a bear arm. And then, oh, there's what's left of the face. You can see the little nose there. And then, we got some bear legs. Yeah. She just likes to make a mess. What are you doing, hey girl? What are you, what you doing? Are you just hanging out in the kitchen? Can I watch your mama put away all the all the food from the grocery store? Guess what? I got you uh, something fun. See that pitiful little toy you got there in front of you? Yeah. Want to see what I got for you? You ready? I got you a new toy. I got you a new toy. Are you ready? Oh, what is that? 
Is that for you? Oh, yes. Okay, let me take a look at it for my camera. Alright, so it's stuffed on the top. I think it squeaks. Oh, it squeaks. Here's how they grow. Oh, boy. Okay, hold on. Sit. Sit. It squeaks. And it's got a rope thing. So, there it is. Sit. Sit. Do you want your toy? Do you want your toy? Here you go. Do you like your new toy? Shelby girl. Do you like your new toy? Yeah. Are you going to take the tags off first? Yeah. Okay. Should we make it squeak? Can I touch your... Can I, oh, I can't touch your toy, huh? <clears throat> All right. You're so cute. All right. I'll leave you alone to play with your new toy. You're so cute. Are you chewing on your toy? Did it taste good? Yeah? Coolie! What you doing? You staying awake? Oh. What? Oh, gosh. Sadie girl, she's falling asleep on her way to Grandma's house. It's, and then Corbin's underneath that Mickey Mouse blanket. Is he sleeping? Can you stick your head in there and find out if he's sleeping? He's out, huh? Are you excited to go to the cabin? Yeah. Yeah? What do you want to do when we get to the cabin? I think it'll still be raining? Yeah, probably will be. It's alright. We can sit underneath the fire pit. What do you call it? The gaze fire gazebo? And listen to the sounds of the forest. Sadie loves sounds of the forest. Do you like sound of the forest? No. What's the one sound you don't want to hear coming from the forest? Coyotes. Coyotes? Why coyotes? Uh, all right, so we're on our way to Grandma and Grandpa's, and then we're headed to the cabin. There's Carrie, and we're sitting in traffic. There's a the little traffic jam we got going on to get over the Mississippi River. It's like, what time is it? It's almost 5 o'clock, so this is like the worst time to be going on this road. But it's okay, because we want to get to the cabin. So we'll deal. Right, Carrie? That's right. All right. What are you keep waiting? Yeah. <laughs> what are you excited about for camping? The for the campfire. Camp the campfire. Camp time. Of course. And I, I'm really looking forward to chopping, doing some wood too. So oh, chopping yeah, and hauling, yeah. and that's fun for me. Yeah. Are we going to do that or are we going to be working on the cabin? Well, he said chopping and cabin work, so I don't know. A little bit of both. Right? I think we might have a little bit of both going on. I suppose this time of year they're all gearing up because, you know, they didn't bring enough in last year. Yes, we are. They so, almost, they went down to like two logs left before it got warm. <laughs> uh, yeah. But it's supposed to be a harder winter, so maybe they're getting ahead of yes. time. Because that harder winter is going to take back that whole huge pile yeah. on the back that they got going. They have this huge pile on the back. It's like, I don't know. It's like <laughs> five feet tall and it's probably ten, five, ten. five, ten rows? Ten rows or ten so. Rows? Yeah. yeah. It's not a little bit of wood, it's a lot. And it's not little pieces, it's like ginormous like stumps and yeah. stuff. Plus the woodshed's already full. Right. And so we're gonna load up in front of the woodshed. Oh, to the driveway. Oh, to the driveway, yes. <laughs> not sure where else we're gonna put it, but we'll find a spot. <coughs> yes. Alright, well we'll see you later. Happy oh. birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Corbin. Happy birthday to you. Can I have Oh, my, you got a lot of girlfriends. Oh, my goodness. I want them. Well, but you were. I was holding them. Good job. You were showing. Well, we're at the cabin. It's a beautiful morning. There's Sadie. We have... A nice day today, I think. First day of fall weather, finally. I wanted to show you the new addition to the cabin. Grandpa put a porch off the deck. Put a roof over the porch, which is awesome. 
because yesterday it was raining and it worked out nicely. Also, look at this over here. Grandma and Grandpa got a new toy. A two-seater RZR. So first time at the cabin with it. They just picked it up last week. Oh, I'm not getting a very good. There we go. There it is. It's got a windshield and everything. Pretty cool. Look at that thing. And it's so quiet, too. At least for people listening. And then here's the inside. Bucket seats. And there's the controls. It's like a little car. Pretty cool. What do you think, Sadie? Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Yeah. And look, it even has a little trunk area. How cool is that? So, Grandpa had to go to work this morning. He has to work on Saturday, like once every four weeks, and today is his day. So he told us what we needed to do today. This is the deck off the front of the, uh, the cabin, and we are getting ready to start the Houston edition. You see over here where this post is? We're gonna build a wall across, and enclose that end of the porch for another room for sleeping. Ooh. So, my plan for today is we have to take off all the deck boards or, so we can put some new flooring on. And here's the flooring that's all ready for us. So that is the plan for the day. Oops. Okay, so this is what we got done. We got the flooring cut to size. Took all the deck boards off. No more deck boards. Flooring cut. Got the paneling off the side of the wall. Built that wall. Put the plywood up, and then we have one starter of the wall over there. All in one day's worth of time. Not even a day's worth of work, right, Did Grandpa? Yeah. Yeah. 